Cap Cave View First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Good Tuesday evening, everyone. Hope you've had a wonderful day today. Yes, more cloud cover today. We thought we'd see a little bit more sunshine, but just did not happen. Those clouds kind of hung around. Now we do have some shower activity very soon getting to, if not right now, Ellensburg, Yakima, Toppenish. It is slow moving and it should dissipate as we move into the next couple of hours, but a little bit of shower activity is possible and we could see some in the mid Columbia tomorrow. I'll show you that in a bit. So as we look at our temperature trend, look at this cooling trend. We are well below our average of 73 and it's going to get even cooler in our next work week. If we don't see freezing temperatures this week for your city, we'll most likely see it next week, if not very close to it. So do get ready for the chill to be coming in our area. So a bit warm today for the Tri-City, 75, 70 in Hermiston. Other than that, we're in the upper 60s, 58 in Ellensburg. Very cool there. And that's most likely due to heavy winds today. Now winds are going to slow down as we head into the evening hours, but 17 miles per hour for Ellensburg, 20 for Prosser and Toppenish and double digits for most of our areas. Light winds tomorrow. Those light winds should continue at least for our work week. Winds could spike a little bit in our uh, weekend. So just a little bit of shower activity sticking around in the Yakima Valley. And then as we move into tomorrow morning, we have this wall coming in very thin, very quick but just gonna slowly move into the Blues Mountains and then move to the east. Other than that, we're looking very nice for our next couple of days, though Sunday, as we see a big cool down coming. I know, from what? Uh, we are gonna be seeing cooler temperatures, could see some shower activity. Uh, kind of all over the place, 50 for the Tri-Cities overnight, overnight tonight, 36 for Ellensburg. Most of our places are in the 40s. As we head into our Wednesday, can it be midweek already? More cloud coverage for the uh, mid-Columbia. It looks like a little bit of sun breaks for uh, the Yakima Valley. Mid to lower 60s, even upper 50s for Ellensburg and Dayton. Seven-day forecast, Tri-City is going to be in those mid to lower 60s through Sunday with that good chance of showers. And then 58 for Monday, excuse me, and Tuesday into the 30s in our overnight periods. But... No sign of the freezing mark just yet. For Yakima, overnight tomorrow night, 33. That is knocking on the door, and we should see it next week as well. So, folks, cool temperatures are here. Do get ready, though, for some sun breaks tomorrow, just a bit chillier than today.